this Lodi neighborhood on Botticelli Way is no stranger to flooding. Residents say heavy flooding has impacted the neighborhood for the past few years. Probably close to a foot of water on each corner next to the uh, uh, Raphael and uh, Botticelli. With the heavy rain expected this weekend, resident Francisco Zamora says he won't be surprised if it happens again. There was a couple of cars that were damaged and a couple of the yards, all the bark that washed out from the homes. Much of the past flooding, he says, has happened to his neighbors, but he's not taking any chances. Well, I keep all the uh, leaves out of all the storm drains if I can or you know, drain out the uh, back. If I, have that, I got a pretty good drain system. County officials say maintenance crews are on the lookout for potential flood conditions. Some of the areas that in particular with this storm that we're watching um, are along the McCullamy River mostly in the north part of the county. All residents are asked to stay vigilant on the roads and officials say now is the time to ensure your home is protected. The hope is that residents are going out and cleaning their gutters, that we have city county crews that are also going out and making those clearances as well. County officials say they are prepared for a wet and cold weekend. But there is a chance for some folks in need to stay warm. This Oak Park Senior Center is just one of several warming centers that's set to open in Stockton starting this weekend. Others in include the Arnold Brew, Stribley, and Van Busker Community Centers. These will be open from Sunday until January 6th. In Stockton, Josie Hart, KCRA 3 News.